Mr. Producer's making no sense at all. Should I tell them what you were just saying? Nah, let's not. I'm going on my holiday tomorrow. I've got nothing packed, no makeup packed, no clothes packed, but I've got time to do a parcel opening. <sighs> yes. Right. Well, I'm hoping you're keeping it. <laughs> We sat around for months now to write today. Mr. Bruce ordered it ready. Just in case. It is a smartphone grip. A bit like what Mr. Producer is using right this second. But for some reason, you need, why did you need a second one again? For my phone. Do you, do you like my sexy husky voice? I could sing the blues. Smelly cat, smelly cat. <laughs> yes, it's a filmmaker handle. Tripod mount. And a traveller stand. Oh, did you know that? It's a stand as well. I bet you didn't know that, did you? Did you know that? Okay. S1 smartphone grip. It looks very professional. Did, did we get it from China or from this country? From from the air. It was airmail, was it? <laughs> from upstairs. <laughs> well, you looked up. Where did we get it from? Over there. Oh, cool. I was over there. Ooh. Got a leather grip. I got a smarter one than you. <laughs> so right. Are you a mobile creative? Tell your story. At Shoulder Pod, we design and craft professional mobile equipment for visual creatives and storytellers. Right. So he's not showing me how to use this. So it should be simple. A bit like an IKEA box. Simple. But what would you like me to do? I was putting things inside the box. So I can't really hold things while I'm putting things inside. Are you moaning already? Are you sure now? Are you sure now? Right, I'm presuming there's a hole there. So, and there's a hole there. So that slides onto the hole. I'm only presuming here, am I right? Here. You're not nodding or anything, Mr. Producer. If I break it, it's your fault because you're not taught me how to use it. You give a little twist, give a little shout, make sure it's straight, make sure it's straight. You're going to say that right there. So that's the bit that goes onto the tripod. No? That doesn't screw down onto the tripod. What are you on about then? That bit, that screws down onto the tripod. No. What's that bit for then? You don't actually know. Has yours got one? You don't have to turn it upside down or what? <laughs> Look, we've got some destructions. Right, open the grip by turning the sunscreen. Never mount your smartphone if it shows signs of having a damaged screen, damaged body or damaged case. I fixed all that the last time we did a video of them. Place your smartphone in the middle of the lower V-shaped rubber pad. Okay, so basically you unscrew that bit. It says here. big enough. I need to go a bit bigger. Oh, you know why they say about not doing it if it's got a smash screen or anything? Because then you, they can't be blamed for smashing it with a grip. That should be wide enough. It's not. My phone's not very wide. Is it sliding, does it? So I think I'm going to have room. <laughs> Doesn't matter which way up the phone goes. It's very hard to do when you've got a rubber phone case. There we go. And we slide too far. Right there a bit. Then you tighten it back up gently. Turn the thumb screw gently until you feel a light contact with the grip. Tighten your device securely by applying no more than one full turn to the thumb screw. Don't apply force when tightening the grip as this can cause damage to your smartphone. So you need that. That's wrong then. That's not. Do I just turn that around? I know. I was thinking, what have I done wrong? So you don't straighten that up then. Told you it'd be like the IKEA furniture. And then that 
goes around the wrist. Ta-da! Look, it's a mirror image. Do I have to? Well, what if I've done it wrong? Ta-da! I was scared I've done it wrong then. You know. Make sure your device is held tightly in place by trying to slide it literally from the grip. No, that's not shifting. That's what it says. My voice keeps going very squeaky. I'm itchy and scratchy all rolled into one. I love how it's in all these different languages. Yes. So there we go. Should I turn it around? <laughs> I, I, it's like I'm looking at a mirror image. What? Have I got that wrong? Unscrew it. Keep unscrewing it. That bit goes on the tripod. Ah, uh, you see, when you don't do a script, Mr. Producer, I don't know what you're on about. Plus, look. It's a travel mount. That's what it looks like in the picture. Look, look there. That's what I've done. Do, 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 do. So you can stand it on your desk if you need to. You know, or film from this position. Hello! You know? You want to screw that bit back on now? Are, are you sick of me showing that bit off? yours isn't brown but mine is did it specify on the um, internet <laughs> mirror <laughs> we're twinnies yay you want me to get up what for okay <laughs> look du, 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 du. ah mr producer <laughs> <laughs> right, I've got to stand here and do it with my spiel now whilst talking to you through my phone. Yes. Thank you for watching me build up, ready for my holiday tomorrow. I hope you just didn't know trip over my case then. Yeah, okay. Subscribe to all four of my lovely channels and follow me on Twitter and Instagram. You need to follow me on Twitter because I'm telling you, in the next three days, there's going to be so many photos. It's unbelievable. Saturday, I'll take UK. And I'll talk to you all very soon. Goodbye from me. Goodbye from Mr. Producer and goodbye from my smoke phone. Goodbye.